Hello everyone, welcome back to your channel Physics with Oliver. Today we will discuss another problem from Logic Kit. Okay, at first start the problem. If you have not subscribed yet, then please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon. Okay, before solving the problem, we have to know how to understand this diagram. Okay, see this is A, B, C. Three inputs are given, right? But it is not given in that manner. Uh, in the truth table manner, it is not given. From this diagram, we will make a truth table at first. Okay. A, B, C. From this diagram, we will make the truth table. C. For the first half, this is the first half, this is second, this is third, this is fourth, this is fifth and this is sixth. Okay, for the first one we can see this is 0, 0 and this is 5, right? 0 volt means we can write it as low. 0 volt means we can write it as low. And for the C it is 5 volt. So we will write it as high. This is 1, okay? See the second portion. See the second portion. This is 5 volt. This is 0 volt. This is 5 volt. So A is high, B is low and C is again high. Okay. Now see the third portion. A is 0, B is 5, C is again 0. So A is low, B is high and C is again low. And for the next one, A is high, B is high and C is low. A is high, B is high and C is low. The next one, A is low, B is low, C is high. So this should be 0, 0, 1. Next one, A high, B low, C high. A high, B low, C high. Okay, is that clear? From this, we will make y from here. See, this is AND gate. This is NAND gate. And this is OR gate. I hope you all know the operation of AND gate, OR gate and NAND gate. Okay. So, for the first one, 0, 0, 1. A is 0, B is 0 and C is 1. You can see. So, for 0, 0, from AND gate we will get 0. For 0, 1, for AND gate we will get 0 and for NAND gate we will get 1. If we put 0, 1 on the OR gate, we will get 1, right? So the output will be 1. Okay. Now for the next one, I am deleting this. For the next one. For the next one, this is 1, 0, 1. 1, 0, 1. For 1, 0, AND gate will be 0. For 0, 1, NAND gate will be 1. For 1, 0, OR gate will be 1. So this should be 1. Okay. Now for the next one. Zero, one, zero. Zero, one, zero. For 0, 1, AND gate will be 0. For 1, 0, NAND gate will be 1. For OR gate, if we put 0, 1, we will get 1. In this manner, you will calculate the entire truth table and you will get 1 for every set. So, from here we can say the output will always be high. Now we will show the options which are given in the question. Now see the options. You can see for the option C, the output is always at 5 volt. And from uh, here we get that for all inputs the output is 1. That means output is always high. So option C will be the right answer. If you don't know the operation of the AND gate and the OR gate, I will write it for you. A, B, C, this is for AND gate. If 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1 is given, for 0, 0, this is for AND and this is for NAND. 
I will write. Okay, this is C bar. This should be 0, 0, 0, 1 and this should be 1, 1, 1, 0. Okay, and for OR gate I am writing this. This is for OR gate and this is for NOR gate. Okay. 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. This should be 0, 1, 1, 1 and this should be 1, 0, 0, 0. If you don't know the truth table of AND, NAND, OR or NOT, then this will help you. I hope you can understand the problem. Thank you everyone for watching. Don't forget to subscribe the channel.